This is a quick walkthrough using favourites inside the sentencing guidelines application. Favourites are simply offences that we're expecting to deal with that we've noted from our court listing. So when we first start using the application, favourites and history are all blank. They don't contain any marked items. So from my court listing, I may be able to spot I have a number of offences that are listed and the order in which I click these, they will be placed into my favourites list. So, so therefore, what I would try and do is find my offences in the order that I'm expecting them to appear from my court listing. So all the items that we've just clicked or made favourite will appear upon my favourites list. So I've now prepared just a short court hearing with these offences and clicking any of these offences takes me to the offence guideline where I can zoom in and look at that particular offence. I can also click the previous page if there's any information on the reverse or the overside to that particular offence. When I finish with that, I'll just click the Done button and we're back to the offences. So I'm using any of these indexes to locate and view an offence. Now, I may be unsure which offence I need to highlight. I can still go into view an offence, confirm that's the one we need and check and that is then re-added to our favourites. So evade TV license payment, license payment. Okay, so that's pretty straightforward. So if you're like me, you've got fairly large fingers and you miss the star, you can still restar an item through the offence guideline. Okay, so we've just really dealt with this, this single favourites pop-up, but we have others here as well. So if there's an offence, oh, an additional guideline that I'd like handy, I can add it into my favourites. It will appear here, but also in a slimmed down list of just the guidelines I need to reference. Correspondingly, if I was looking at explanatory material, perhaps no reliable information on earnings. Having made this favourite, this will appear both in favourites, but also under explanatory material. Perhaps more important to chairman is the ability to go into pronouncement cards, we'll pick adult court, and highlight any discharge, conditional or absolute. In other words, any probable pronouncements we would expect to give for this court hearing. So if I know I have a health order in the listing, I can probably include that. I may also expect some of these depending on the court. So having highlighted these pronouncements, they're then available to the chairman and he can quickly jump through to that particular conditional bail within the pronouncement guide. Okay, and again, the same applies if I've gone into pronouncement cards, um, I find a particular offence a pronouncement, I can still restar this or refavorite it from that little star button inside the pronouncement cards. So foreign travel order now appears under pronouncements. We can also, just back to here, we can also make favorite documents we add in through iTunes into our My Documents list. I don't have any listed there, 
but you'll find another wiki entry describing how to do that. That is a quick summary of using favorites.